Did you chew any louder, Dad? I like these are crispy. These are kettles. Terry's kettle. Terry's kettle. Not a sponsor. Oh gosh! What flavor is that? So many. <laughs> <laughs> that was not exposed. It was just Woo! straight up regular. Wow. That'll make you pucker up. Well. Woo! Yeah. Dang, Terry. I think he swiped his armpit across these. <laughs> there you go. Thanks. <laughs> you, you, you won't want Terry's salt and vinegar? Mm. I like that. I'm good. Is this deer still out there? It was a while ago. I don't see him right now. No, I could be that. down over the knoll there. drinking this so if we go straight this way it'll be five minutes that way over there right? something like that what <laughs> oh hi hey <laughs> in black country out here's nothing back country. Now, Corey, did you say he's gonna cross that field with a six-year-old boy? <laughs> I'm gonna cross that field with a six-year-old boy. <laughs> what we're gonna yeah. do? Hey, hey, what we gonna do? Once, 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 once the daylight, once the daylight, once the sun goes down, we're gonna, we're gonna, we're gonna, we're gonna one, one by one, we're gonna go across that. We're gonna go across that field right there. We're gonna run across that field right there. We're gonna hide the backpacks on our back. I'm gonna haul ass, I'm gonna haul some dad across there, right down, right on the other side, ridge line, right on the wolf line there, and in the bush there, that's where the house is on. Okay, I think I got that. <laughs> I don't know what you got on that one, man. Would you like a, would you like a honey roasted almond?
Oh, look at this. That is gorgeous. Let's get in here. Yeah, I think this is the kitchen. Yeah. You want to go by yourself for a little bit? Or yeah, there? I'm sure this house isn't big enough that we we'll get lost. So <laughs> I'll go this way. Okay, I'll, I'll just go this way since it's a good start. Okay. See you a little bit. See ya. This is the old house that's along the Interstate um, 81 uh, in the near, uh, well, it's near, um, well, Marion. It's a nice place. I don't know what it was, it was just a house. And I mean, it's right along the interstate. <laughs> Try not to show um, light out the windows. Those are like church pews. These church pews, actually. Cool. It's pretty awesome. This is an old house. I would just guess 18, 1880s, just as a guess. Uh, by looking at the wood and the doors, some of the doors and the architecture. I'll say 1880. I may find out differently, but we'll see. Of course, got oak wood floors, big fireplaces, really cool. Really cool. ceilings. It's nice. Big blocks of oak right there. Looks like somebody's trying to build a fire or something. I don't know what's going on. A coal box? Cool. Old wooden box. <laughs> Hope I don't run into anything scary. Oh my gosh! <laughs> How you doing? I'm doing all right. Have you noticed that there's a uh, fireplace in about every room? Yeah. Yeah, a big, a not a little place. fireplace, a big, humongous one. Like there's literally this big one, and then in here there's another one. But you got to remember, that's the only way they had to heat their house. They didn't have electricity or nothing. Electric. Did you see the church pews in there? Yeah. What the, what? what? I think maybe. They house 15 people in here. Maybe they use it for a church for a while, you think? Maybe so. Or maybe just use it for storage. Um, yeah, maybe the, the church put it in there. Yeah, it could be. It's nice. It is. These are 
These are wild. I wonder what it's just like a kind of a big thick a big door, big wide entrance way in it. Interesting. Ooh, interesting. In there, it's where it's starting to fall in the most. Over now. I'm gonna do it now before it gets too dark because it's kind of open. There's a oh, hole. Is it? In it. Okay. Oh, really? Yeah, that's the side of the house that's going first. Gotcha. Gotcha. Okay. Wow. Hopefully nobody sees our lights. Oops. Bathroom. And that's a big hole in the wall right there. Yeah, house might be able to see us. It's cool. Okay. Unfortunately, there's just a lot of open open windows and stuff, and we did have to go through a big field to get here. It's probably got seen by about 10 or 15 people. Hopefully, nobody really cares whether you come in here or not. And big old windows. Now look at the overhead. Wow, that's cool. Some of the big old wowie. Wowie. That's where I came in right there. It's probably the front door. Pretty nice. Very nice, very nice. Broke a glass. See, that's the reason why people don't like for you to get in their buildings is they do stuff like this and make a big mess for everybody else. And uh, I wouldn't want somebody in my building either if they're going to tear it up. Especially, you know, old buildings like this should not be messed with. The way I came in just a minute ago. God, it goes up pretty high. Okay. Um, I'm gonna go on at the. Uh, I think I'll go on the other side of the house and get all of it, and then I will come back. set of stairs small bathroom and see Low ceiling. Low ceiling. Watch your noggin. Man, that's bumped my head coming up through there. <laughs> What's going on? It's like Aquaman. Oh my gosh. It is it? <laughs> That's neat. It's a nice setup. Mm -hmm. <laughs> interesting. Interesting. It is interesting. Isn't it? There's some big doors for dwells, I think. Dude, yeah. Well. Yeah. Old phones. Oh, yeah. Not as old as they could be if it was a 
Do you not have a mask there? No. Well, both of y'all got a mask on? You want mine? No, I got one, actually. I put it on just to be sure. I don't know if Aaron does or not. I haven't okay. seen it. All right, I'll put one on. Oh gosh, what's with these mermaids like? I don't know, man. That's I guess that was a thing. Some sort of like cuddle doll or something? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> okay, got my mask on and I'm a tripod. We're probably not going to be as detailed as we can be because a lot of windows are open. Oh, we just got a basement. No, it's downstairs. Okay. Ironing board. Another bathroom. Well, hopefully, nobody will see us. The cares. It. Hard to take a video of it though. Close. Hang it up. Winter cotton and nylon socks. So it's written on the box. <laughs> Okay, we have some electric, some electric, and okay, okay. Scary. <laughs> We know you're here. <laughs> yeah, probably. Well, they've, they've made these houses so strange in a way. They are big. Look like someone is camping out. Another coal box. Broke some more glass. They wouldn't do that. 1842. Now, I don't know if that has anything to do with anything. But it could be. I doubt that's really 1842. The handles. Mm -hmm. Cool. Okay. Front door and by comes Corey. I'm pretty sure there's bats up there. Oh, is there? <laughs> you better the, the wallpaper's peeling off in real time. <laughs> Are they having one of them bad orgies again? No, no bad orgies. No, okay. No. All right. <laughs> oh man, that's a pretty cool shot there. Yeah, this is a nice spot right here. It's like this. Yeah. So this is three floors, isn't it? At least. One, two, two, three. Rooms there. Two rooms. Have you been up here? Not yet. Okay. I'll go, I'll go ahead and go, go up here and take a quick look. I'm going to take a second break. My back's hurting. Oh, wow. Here and it goes here, then it goes up another flight. Yeah. Wow. <laughs> Hey, this is, light, this is bright as my light gets. So I guess that's as good as going to get, right? Are you good? Hey. Wow, this is really cool. I'll tell you what, coming down here, you would definitely be in good shape if you come down here all the time. Oh, 
sure what that is. Got a rabbit. A rabbit pie. Looks like stuff that's uh, book covers, maybe. Not for sure. Lots of things. Lots of mice up here. over here too. Household goods and stuff, clothing, paper bags from Food City. It's really nice, man. This place is really nice. You may not be able to hear me too well, but. Because I got this mask on now, I'm just kind of talking low anyhow. Do you see how? I think it goes down under there, if I'm not mistaken. We'll have to check that out. It may not. place uh, it, it could date back as far as the 40s 50s 40s probably maybe older I don't know I'm not for sure what that was it's some kind of electrical plug-ins lights I guess <laughs> I got to figure out if I come up them steps, but I did. I remember. I think that's where you do your head right there. Yeah, I bumped my head right on that. Yeah. Hey, you should have your EMF meter out. <laughs> yeah, really. Especially in the red room. The red room? Yeah, right there. Yeah. Turn it on. See if we get any beliefs. Let's do it. Go for it. I'm going to go ahead and set this up. Just let the video a little bit. Do we go around and ask questions? We've never done that before. Well, we... I'm going to go ahead and set, uh, 
Set up uh, and do this uh, EMF reading. Huh. Well, shoot, I, I didn't even come in here. Somehow I missed that. How this did I miss that? This one's the creepiest one I've ever It is the creepiest one, isn't it? So, how are we doing here? Yeah, I think that's what we'll do. Just going to set it right over here. I think I should set it in the window. Since this one's blocked off, it should be okay, right? This is our EMF reading. It's supposed to detect uh, ghosts or something or some kind of interference in the magnetic force. The light goes up. You've probably seen it on other channels. This is the first time we've used it. I got that as a uh, Father's Day present. <laughs> Pretty cool. So we're going to turn it on. There it is. I'll put a close up shot here. One light. Takes a while. Yeah, 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 it's just, just for fun. 
It's not that we believe it goes, but if it goes off, something's making it go off. That's what we're doing. We're just fooling around. We're not trying to say there is such thing as spirits and stuff roaming all over the place. But if it goes off, then uh, it would be nice to know exactly what is making it go off. And it's just a, something that we would never know unless we had that piece of equipment. So, so far, nothing's blinked or I think if it goes up to yellow, then you've got a pretty good signal on that. I'll take a walk through the house to see if it goes off. This yeah. one just had to be one of the creepiest rooms in the house. I'm going to try it at first. Is your GoPro yeah, video? It's, it's, it's a, you're pretty sure it's got. Can it see that? Or do you want to set it to where you can actually see yeah, it? Yeah, I can see it. Oh, you're looking on your camera. Okay. Cool. I can see it. High tech. All right. We'll, uh, we'll walk around. We'll come back and then we'll check it out. Sounds good. Okay. So let, let it rip. Oh yeah, let me get those wings on here. I didn't get a shot of that actually. Yeah. Like Aaron said, it has wings and it has places here to hook pictures. So it could be people that passed away that lived in the house. Or animals. Or animals or anything. I said the wings of time. Or maybe just pictures of people who lived here. And not necessarily died, but you know, odds are if this house was built in the 1800s, which it probably was. And then there's people who's passed away. And that's one reason, because it's an old house, that's the reason why we've got the EMF device on, just to see if it'll pick up anything. Really cool. I miss this room. Yeah, I did too. <laughs> we got our EMF down there, and uh, look at the wings on the wall right here behind you and you notice what well, you notice between them wings each one of them the wings of time they yeah. have portraits hanging yeah. from their relatives exactly or people who lived here that passed away that owned it or something see someone did such a good job here I know this place is abandoned I know and you got some, you got some dickhead I know yeah they know this is a really cool room yeah and what's like kind of it's really cool. This is the coolest room. Yeah, I think this is a child's room. What do you think? At I one think, time. I can tell whoever lived here was artistic. Thing. Yes, it was. Because there's there's one room that's got mermaids in it. Yeah. Somebody, I don't think it's a kid's room. I think it was somebody who was like really in the art. Because there's paintbrushes okay. and everything. Yeah, well maybe this was their room to to do their, do their uh, artistic I feel like the whole house stuff. It's, it's all over the house. Yeah, they've decorated the place themselves, that's for sure, at one time. This may be, you know, this this house might have been built in the 1800s. Some of this artwork you're seeing may be 50, 75, 100 years old. And that room over there said 1845, but I don't know if that's true. 1845 over the top of the fireplace? Yeah. 1842 or 1845, something I forget. I don't know about that. Yeah, it was. Uh, <laughs> yeah. I mean, like you said, this doesn't seem like one person's huge house. This seems like a, a residence for multiple families, like, like a boarding house, like you said. That's what it seems yeah. Because like. yeah. there's multiple big rooms, they all got three fireplaces, there's beds, and there's 200 pairs of shoes here. Like one person doesn't have 200 pairs of shoes. Uh, unless you're a shoe holic. <laughs> yeah, there is. I wonder yeah. who was right to eat, what photo was right to that. Maybe the people that got married in, in this house or something. It kind of looks like something like that, you know? Yeah, it's great the wall. That's where, the, that's where the bed went, probably in some wall. Yeah. Oh, someone yeah, that's probably the reason I didn't finish the, the painting right there because the bed was covered. Maybe. Just yeah. guessing, I don't know. Probably had Just neat. It's really neat. This is, this is this is a cool house. I'm glad we waited to come over here because it's it's hard to get into. It's hard to get into because lots of people. Lots of people. There's a a lodge across the road. The yeah, it's dark. Yeah, well, it don't matter then. See yeah. See yeah. I mean, we'll use a flashlight. Walk on out. Has this moved? 
Nothing yet. And I asked, I said, if there's any spirits in here uh, that are living in the house, to go ahead and just get near the, the device with the green light on it. Just let us know of your presence. And let us know of your presence, right. And we're going to walk around. Aaron's actually filming it with his GoPro over there on the floor. So. Yeah, he's right in the way right now. Yeah, that's all right. He didn't know it was there. I don't get it. We need a light set up in here. Do we have an extra light we can put in here? Nah, I don't I've got a green light. If you can see the green light, then you don't have to have light in here. Okay. And then let's leave and see if I can see it. I mean, I've got, a, I've got stuff in here that we could probably use. Yeah, I'll leave mine right here. And I'll just yeah, just set it over here on the floor. So I've got a glow stick. <laughs> I got this right here too. Here we go. All right, see any metal of this thing on there? Um, what if I just kind of set it right here? Yeah. 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 Think that'd help me? Sure. I'll just leave my bag there. Cool. Oh, yeah, that's good. Oh, is it? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Okay. Nice. <sighs> All the decorations they put on the stairs and stuff. They, do you know it's even painted up, up the stairwell? That's what I'm saying. Little designs. Painted everything. Yeah. I'm gonna go check up upstairs. I've been up there before. You haven't been up there. There's one uh, bath that I saw over here on the wall somewhere upstairs on the as you're going up the left set of steps right here beyond your right. Yep. That's pretty well made. Yes. Good good looking yeah, shelf. You see how the bird poop right down that rail here is that where they sit there? Yeah, yeah, they've got in here and just sit there. That's their, their spot, wasn't it? Well, probably all that handrail is pretty much trashed. Yeah, this is, this is a nice place. I'm, I'm ringing wet. <laughs> it's all right, man. These locks, I've seen these locks before um, in our old in the old house I was brought to. And it was built in the in a, in late 1800s. It locks latches like that. Big, thick, solid doors. Very nice. And decorated up. I mean, you know, they didn't they didn't hold back on a lot of these houses. They just let her in. I guess that there. You think that was the front door? It is cool chicken. Uh, we're on the second floor. Oh yeah. Well, that must have been the balcony then. Yeah, I don't think I'd open that door if it did open. Well, look at that latch, man. That is super cool. Right outside? Yeah. That's a heavy duty latch. What's bush, it say? Bush Co. Or bush. bush Co. Bush. It's Bush S. O. Yeah. You just told the converter. Yeah, man. Like it's pretty cool. It's it's a cool. cool statue. <laughs> Some more shelving. Do this like a breather. Take a little breather. Mm -hmm. I'm used to this. Oh yeah. Work right. a health kit. I wear this 12 hours. All day long, right? Mm -hmm. It's just the humidity is up pretty good, so it's uh, it's hot. It's mm -hmm. cool. Look at that. Look at the entrance way just into the next room. So cool, creative. Yeah, I know. Yeah, I'm having to step around it now. 
Yeah. As soon as I mention the fleet, it's not here. Yeah. <laughs> So far, the boy has not come on, so according to, to that, if it doesn't pick up any EMF readings, there's probably maybe no ghost here, or no, nothing to set it off. But I ain't going to walk around with it in my hand. And uh, see what happens. I got everything. Oh. Okay, I'm walking around with the with this meter. If we'll see if it goes off. If it doesn't, I mean, as far as we know, there's no there's no history on them on ghosts or anything like that here in this this place. But we got to do some research on it. If we can find anything on it. So, we'll go out towards the front here. Or we're on the second floor, so it's not the front. And see what happens. Sure, what these ropes were. I've been here a while ago, but I didn't have the meter. Find uh, it here. It's always easy for me to get lost. <laughs> Here's 1842. I'm not sure that's what, if that's for real. But, uh, it is what it is. I'm going down the steps. Down to the second floor. Yeah. Okay, coming your way. The meter didn't go off. All right. Okay. Break out of here. All right. I'll tell you what, I want to. Well, I got a table. I'm going to go ahead and pack my stuff up right here so I don't have to carry all the stuff so I can fall off of it. Okay, man. See y'all. All right. See ya. Hey, another, thank right. you for joining us on another episode of the Urbex Society. Be sure and, to like and, 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 and turn that dad's <laughs> holding the camera. Be sure to like and subscribe. And, uh, you know, be verbal. Leave a comment because, you know, let us know if you like our videos. A lot of people are watching. Uh, people aren't really talking and they aren't really yeah. subscribing, so be sure to subscribe and leave a comment for it's us. It's a really nice, really nice find in this house. It's yeah. beautiful. It's, it's still beautiful. Yeah. Even after all this house, who knows, this house might not be here 
in just a couple of years. So it's good that we got it documented so that if it's not here anymore, you know, you can come back to this video and check it out. That's right. Yeah. All right. Adios, fellas. Adios, See y'all. See you next time. time.